learn new forms. In this lesson, we're going to go through three movements. Let me show you the first one. So you can see it's open and closed. The only thing you have to remember is how to go back to that position. So follow me. Turn the left heel inwards. Then ship your weight. Turn the right toe inwards. So both your foot are parallel. Roughly shoulder width and your hands just naturally come to that open and close position. Follow me one more time. Turn the heel in, turn the toe in. Open, close. One more time. Turn the heel in, turn the toe in. Open, close. The next movement is single whip. Follow me. Ship your weight. Step to the left and touch down with the ball of your foot first. Put your foot down. Weight forward. Push your hands forward, turn your palm, open up, and look at the right hand. Follow me again. Weight shift, step. Instead of stepping forward, you step back a little bit, about the same as one fist distance, but instead of forward, you're stepping a little behind that's why you land it with the ball of your foot first. Then the foot down, weight forward, hangs forward, turn your palm, open up. One more time. Shift weight, step behind, foot down, weight forward, open up, look at the right hand. Turn the right toe in and let your right hand come down to next to your right hip. Follow me again. Right toe in, right hand down. One more time. Right toe in, right hand down. So your right hand comes down to the hip just like where the other hand's position usually are, in front of the hip. Right hand down, right toe in, and then you shift your weight to the right foot, and then you lift the left heel up and straighten your left foot so you're now facing to the left. And turn your left palm, and you're looking at the middle finger and look past the finger. Let's do that again. Right toe in, right hand down, shift weight, lift the left heel up, straighten up. Now, I like to talk to you about this particular pose. Even though here is not a movement. Here is a transitional movement moving to the fist and the elbow. Elsewhere, it's a full movement. And it's a very nice movement. Let me show you front on. So if you turn, and then you shift your weight, then you can see you're really balanced. And the point of the middle finger 
the point of your nose and the point of your toe, the three points are diagonally facing each other. You can call this the three point one or three in one, my body spirit, three in one. It's a really wonderful way to practice integrating your mind body into one. It's a powerful posture, but it's also very difficult to do. So take care not to put too much weight on the knee when you don't feel you're strong enough to do that. It's quite okay for you to open up and stand up and gradually, gradually train yourself to get more strength and only do that when you're comfortable. Now come back and follow me again. Turn the right toe in, shift your heel, and then take a little step forward. Turn the left palm so you face inward, and then make a fist with the right hand, follow step and punch just underneath the elbow. One more time. Turn the right toe in, straighten the left foot, little step forward, punch on the elbow. One more time. Toes in, weight back, little step forward, punch. Follow Dr. Lamb. Turn the left heel in, turn the right toe in, open, close, step slightly behind, hands forward, turn palm, open up, look at the right hand, turn the right toe, right hand down, adjust your left foot, take a little step forward, punch on the elbow. Let's do that again. Turn the left heel in, turn the right toe in, open, close. Step a little behind to the left. Hands forward, turn your palm, open up, look at the right. Turn the right toe, right hand down, step a little bit and punch under elbow. Okay, excellent. Let's do it one more time. From here, turn the left heel in, turn the right toe in, open, close, step behind, and whether you land on the toe or the heel, it doesn't matter. Hands forward, turn, open up, Turn the right toe in, right hand down, straighten the left foot, little step forward, punch on the elbow. The principle to focus is the weight transfer and the body alignment. This movement is wonderful to practice how your body is aligned, where your weight is, where your energy is, and then when you move, you really need to be aware of where your weight is. So practice it and keep that in mind.